The Natori family are all buried at the same grave and their death certificates are all kept in the same temple. Now, we didn't originally know where the grave was and we tried our best to find the grave. But what happened was, is after searching and searching the area of Wakayama, we gave up a little bit. But about a year later, Yoshie thought to herself, she thought, I know, I will try to find one more time. So she searched on the internet for just Natori and Wakayama and she tried doing another search. Remember, this is after a lot of, a lot of trying. So Yoshie tried again. A couple of years later, she thought, I'll try again. She typed in Natori and Wakayama and she, she, she tried to find something there. And by pure coincidence, a few days before, Yamamoto-san, a monk, had put up a blog for his temple and he'd said that in the heavy wind and the heavy rain, the, the grave of the Natori family had been damaged. Please can the Natori family come and look after the grave or, you know, come and see him. We were like, oh, I wonder if it's the same Natori. So we spoke to him, we spoke to Yamamoto-san and we found it. We absolutely found the grave of Natori Masazumi, you know, the main sort of character in Natori Ryu, and we found the graves of all the other samurai. And now what we've done is we've actually had a ceremony to put the grave back. We've put the grave from storage back in a position in the graveyard next to some of Yamamoto's ancestors. Yamamoto-san looks after everything there at the temple. He leads the temple and he's quite a forward-thinking monk. He has blogs, he has uh, study groups, he even has uh, a shoninki reading group starting to go over the shoninki. At the time, they didn't know who Natori Masazumi was and we came along and we showed them the shoninki and we told them what it was. And they were extremely excited about this and the monk has now set up um, some display boards for the graves. He's taken Natori's grave out of storage, he's taken the death tablets out of storage, he's doing his best to research and um, Yamamoto-san, he's really doing a lot to research Natori Ryu and, he, and we're in partnership with him of course and he's joined my team and, and we're all there together. So you can go to Wakayama, you can even go and see the graves, you can go talk to Yamamoto-san, so please do. So enjoy the pictures below, I've put some pictures up and the, some of the pictures of a ceremony we held. We held a ceremony that was covered by the local press there and it was to bring back the spirit of Natori into the grave and bring him back to the grave to look over the family and look over the future of Natori Ryu. So enjoy the pictures and enjoy the video of the ceremony. 